Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathleen and today's video we are going to be opening up my Owlcrate box for the month of August. Owlcrate is a bookish subscription box. It is $32.99 per month plus shipping and it contains a newly released young adult book as well as about four or five little bookish items. It does have a monthly theme and the theme for the month of August is steeped in folklore. I absolutely love this box and I'm super excited to check it out what they sent us this month so let's go ahead and open it up. Alright so opening up the box, the very top is our spoiler card. Back it just tells you everything you need to know about the items in the box. Alright so the very first item that I see is inside this box and it is uh, another one of our Lord of the Ring Inspire collectible bowls and I really like these I think they're really really pretty and with the new Lord of the Rings Amazon TV series coming out I'm so I'm super excited by the way for that I think this is very appropriate to send out oh this is pretty so here's what it looks like in size it says Riverdale Next item that I see, it looks like it's a little cloth item. It looks like some sort of like tea towel thing. And it says there was a song in this forest. Here's what it looks like. And according to the spoiler card, is a tapestry and it is inspired by Uprooted. And this was designed by Eden Cook. I have not read Uprooted, but I heard it's a fantastic book. So um, this was actually really, really pretty. It is not a tea towel as I thought again, it's a tapestry. All right, then the next item that I see is actually inside this little paper pouch. And it looks like it's a charm. And look at how pretty that is really really pretty bring a little bookish flair to any bag or or jacket with the wolf and the woodsman inspire enamel zipper pool designed in collaboration with the Piketty witch and Joan of art okay so this is not a charm although you could use it as a charm this is an enamel zipper pool and on the back it tells you it's an enamel zipper pool and again inspired by the wolf and the woodsman. The next item that I see is from Riddle's Tea Shop. Looks like it's a sample of tea. This one is called Steeped in Folklore. It is banana flavored. Okay it's not really inspired by anything but it is folklore-ish. So the little pouch says she pulled a pouch of tea from the basket. The bag read in Owl Crate exclusive. It smelled simply delicious. Magic seemed to waft up from the bag as she carefully opened it. She inhaled deeply and it smelled like banana bread. How delightful. She couldn't wait to. So it reads like a book but this is not, it's just like a folklore kind of tea. Next item in the box is our monthly enamel pin. This is our literary luggage collection. This is number 8 of 12. I really like these. I like the fact that they look like luggage. I think they're really pretty. And here is what this month looks like. I really, really, really like these literary luggage pins. I think they're really just gorgeous. And I love the blue in this All one. Alright, and here is the final item. Uh, the back it says, To this day, cranes carry the strands of our fate. Uh, oh, okay, that's so cool. So this is origami paper. That is, that is pretty cool. When I was a child, I used to be obsessed with origami. So I used to make like origami stars, the crane planes. I used to love doing the balloons. And I've learned some other really cool ones that I have since forgot. Okay, so this is inspired by six crimson cranes. So they do teach you just how to make the actual paper cranes. And there are different colored papers so you can try other origamis. But I think that that's really so cool. So that was our last item. So now we're moving on to our book. And our book this month is The Drowned Woods by Emily Jones. I have absolutely never heard of this book. Okay, so with our book, we do get the author letter. It comes with every book, which I absolutely love. This is an exclusive edition. Here's what the original looks like. It looks like they changed the color of the actual book. So it has a deeper background and the title is colored white. Here is what the inside looks like. That's actually really pretty. Foiling on the naked cover and it says the ocean was immoral and patient. Here's the back. It's really pretty. Now it looks like we have 
a reversible dust jacket this is actually really really pretty Alcrate really does a good job with the actual reversible dust jacket it says once upon a time the kingdoms of wales were rife with magic and conflict an 18 year old merit or mare is well acquainted with both as the last living water diviner she can ma manipulate water with magic and it's a skill that many would kill to possess for years Ma mare has been running from the prince who it who bound her into his service in forced her to kill hundreds with her magic. Now all Mare desires is a safe, quiet life, far from power and politics. But that peace is disrupted when Mare's old handler returns with a proposition. Use her abilities to bring down the very prince who abused them both. With a motley crew of allies, including a fake cursed young man, a lady of fees, and a corgi that may or may not be a spy, Mare has to decide there whether to run for the rest of her life or stand and fight for the true freedom that she's always desired. It sounds actually really, really cool. It looks like it has a little bit of magic in it. It looks like there's high stuff. On it so a little bit of a lot of different adventures thrown into one so it sounds actually pretty pretty cool and I'm super excited if you guys have heard of this book and you've already read it let me know how you thought about this book I would love to know your opinions on it anyway that is all for today's unboxing if you are interested in uh, subscribing to Outgrade I will let you guys know what the theme for next month is and the theme for September is Memento Mori here's what it says and the back it says every September box will include an exclusive hand poured candle from Flick the Wick which makes me excited because you guys know how much I love candles so I'm super excited about my Flick the Wick candle um, anyway guys thank you all so much for being here thank you all so much for watching let me know what your favorite item is I'm super excited by the origami kit I'm gonna start doing a bunch of origami who knows maybe I'll post it on Instagram because I've never posted on Instagram you guys can follow me there if you want. It's all linked down below. Anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. All of my social medias are linked down below, including Twitter, Instagram, and Goodreads, and TikTok. Follow if you'd like to follow me on those platforms. Hope to see you guys on my next video. Have a good day, guys, and keep reading. Bye!